All right. Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, build a technical documentation page, user stories, number 13. All right, so when we click on an, pardon me, on a nav bar element, the page should navigate to the, pardon me, to the corresponding section of the main doc element, right? The uh, ID for that. So ergo, if we click on a nav link element that contains the text, hello world, the page navigates to a section element with that ID and contains the corresponding header. Okay, so we're basically gonna just turn all these all these into links all these into links awesome so first thing we're going to do uh we don't have enough room here and i think we'll just get rid of this because we can preview it later so what we're going to do here uh if you don't remember how to do this we've got the nav tag open over here and basically we're just going to do an href and we're going to put whatever it's going to like this is going to a full page uh inside of something i don't know i, I guess that's what the uh Two, two slashes means, and it takes them to the HTML tutorial. But for us, since we're targeting IDs, that's what we got to put in there. And the IDs we're going to be putting in there are these ones right here, uh, like this ID filler text three, ID filler text two, ID filler text one. So right here, <coughs> pardon me, we're going to say href, and then we're going to say that equals ID and lowercase filler uh, underscore text underscore all right and we're going to take this we're going to copy it up to right here and then we're going to get these four right here up to right here and say control v two three four times ah we should have took these ones out let's do this real quick uh take that one out of there also and then control c and get these and control one, two, three, four, V like that. Uh, so now that we've got this, let's just do the old thing where we go one, two, three, four, five. And then over here, five, four, three, two, and one. And let's open up the console and the preview. Uh, and then come down here, run the tests. And look at that, our technical document project should use at least one media query that's probably the next one or the one after that nope it's this one uh and then but we are going to have to do this and we don't have a check for that but no big no big deal uh now we're on to story 14 and we'll see you next time